Hello. My name is David Mello. I'm the Supervisor of Children's Services here at the Fall River Public Library, and I welcome you to our celebration of Children's Book Week, May 3rd through the 7th. Now, in other times, we would have classrooms and daycares and families visiting the library to share stories written and illustrated by a wealth of wonderful authors and, and artists that are out there. But these are different times, so we're coming into your home to share these tales. And to do so, we have some familiar faces from the community who will be sharing these stories with you. And if you enjoy the stories, we hope to see you at the library by giving us a call at 508-324-2700, extension 4, and scheduling a visit. And then you can check out these wonderful stories and all the other wonderful books that we have to offer. We'll be seeing you at the library. Good morning, everyone. I'm going to read you some books this morning that I wrote. And Scholastic Books is the one who published them for me. So I'm going to start off with nursery rhymes. First one I'm going to do is Hickory Dickory Dock. Hickory Dickory Dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one and the mouse ran down. Hickory Dickory Dock. Now, my friend Humpty Dumpty, uh oh, poor Humpty Dumpty, sat on a wall. Oh, Humpty Dumpty, oh. He had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put poor Humpty back together again. Aha! This little piggy went to market. Oh, and this little piggy stayed home. This little piggy had roast beef Oh, and this little piggy had none. And this little piggy cried, Wee, 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 wee! All the way home. And those are the end of this set of nursery rhymes for you. We've got a few this morning. And this one is gonna start off. It's raining, it's pouring, and I actually wrote this one for propaganda. It's raining, it's pouring, the old man is snoring. That's unusual. He bumped his head and went to bed, mm -mm. and he couldn't get up in the morning. Itsy bitsy spider. He climbed up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and the dried up all the rain and itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. Well, now Mary had a little lamb. Its fleece was white as snow. And everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. He followed her to school one day. Uh-oh, that was against the rules. It made the children laugh and play to see the lamb at school. Now, one more to share with you. I wrote a lot of stories, fun stories for boys and girls. And Go to the library and get some out. you find lots and lots of stories there. Jack and Jill. Oh, I like these two kids. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down. Uh oh, he broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. Oh, poor kids. 
Little boy blue, come blow your horn. The sheep's in the meadow. Uh-oh, the cow's in the corn. Where is the boy who looks after the sheep? He's in the haystack, fast asleep. Will you wake him? Oh, no, 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 not at all. No. For if I do, guess what? He's going to cry. Oh, but little Miss Muffet, she sat on a tuffet. She's eating some curds and whey. Yuck, along came a spider and sat down beside her and ah, frightened her away. And those are my stories that I wrote for all of you to enjoy. Thank you.